It's lyrical. It's structurally sophisticated. It's quite a lot like a large musical instrument. It's really thrilling to be standing here in uh, the Wild Beast Pavilion, which we've uh, just completed for CalArts. My name's Craig Hodgetts, my partner is Ming Fung. We began work on this building five years ago and uh, have been experiencing tremendous support from the CalArts administration to build something which for us is a perfect complement to the original CalArts building. Typically, when you know, when we're designing a project, we have you know we have to think about how the space work. But in this situation, it's really about how this space perform acoustically. So that becomes a whole criteria uh, of of designing this. And if you notice, like you know, with all of the acoustical panels, they have different geometry, and they are designed to reflect the to to, to reflect the sound. And then so we have like this kind of curved panels on the ceiling, but at the same time, how, what do you do with the, with the other three walls? And, and how do you make it work both acoustically and at the, at the same time aesthetically pleasing? Because it's really all about kind of geometry and it's about patterning. And so we really uh, struggled for a long time trying to come up with something which works both from a performance point of view, but at the same time, uh, from a uh, uh, kind of a patterning uh, point of view, how those two uh, shapes kind of complement each other. Many of the things in uh, musical instrument design have always been intriguing to us as architects. Um, there's a certain um, fundamental functionality to a musical instrument in which every single piece has some kind of performance, either for resonance or for fingering, for structure. And if you take those qualities and try to transform them into an architectural form, then you find that you get to something that is, is minimal and at the same time very, very rich. And that richness comes partly from the actuators which open the windows, the uh, curved panels, which you see behind me, which reflect sound, uh, the other large uh, curved panels. And, and so I think if you took a photograph of the building and a photograph of a violin and looked at its bridge, its frets, its string board, its um, tuning apparatus, you would see that this has very much the same uh, uh, attitude toward physical design.